shit. Oh. Hi guys. Just gonna do a bit of off-road riding today. There's a couple things I want to do. I didn't really test the limits of the CB500X um, with the Rally Raid products on it. Now, I'm not going to do that when I'm on my own, but I'm going to push it a bit harder than when I've pushed it previously. And I also want to discover a few new areas. This is a place that I come to quite a bit. But it's very big, and I've only really recently been staying on the areas that I'm familiar with. So today I want to do a bit of discovering. And it's been raining a lot, so this is quite a boggy area. Uh, which means it's going to be a lot of water logging. These parts would just never dry up. All right. Okay, my back wheel is spinning a lot here. And yeah, so let's see how we get on today. Getting around here. Get fairly stuck in. This mud is much deeper than it looks. Uh, it is raining, but not too far away. There is a little bit of sunshine, so hopefully we'll get to have a little bit of that. Okay, so. Pegs on either side. I hit the ground pretty badly. Ooh, not too much room for error here at all. Okay, so the bike is definitely feeling this. Okay, so that. <coughs> Ooh. A lot of skidding here. Um, if I'm going to stay up where the grass is, otherwise I'm just not going to get any traction. Oh, she, she's got a oh, motherfucker! Oh. Okay. Not great. So the leg and the ankle got caught onto the bike, which is never the way you want it to be. Okay, turn off the engine now. <laughs> we'll do the old uh, push technique. See if that works. It's a bit uh, slippery for that, but. Ready. Okay, up to the bank, I think. Keep going. Kind of, don't have a huge amount of control over the bike. So it starts taking off in the direction. They're really just trying to guide us rather than prevent it. All right. Steam coming off the bike now because I'm going. It's quite a bit of water.
Okay. I had the uh, the ABS was still on, and uh, I pulled the front brake there, and nothing happened. As a guess, there's a very good reason not to uh, have a windshield if you're going off road. Okay, so it's kind of always something that has the potential to throw you. So they're never going to see everything. So really, because I was standing up. I would have gone head down. I'll do it my neck onto the windshield. At least that's a 
very strong possibility. This is slippery as hell today, so it is hard to kind of gauge your speed. Civilization. 